ladies and gentlemen. Access to information and communication technologies has become indispensable to our modern way of life. The world over, we have come to rely on easy, reliable, and affordable access to mobile communications and online information. The role of the ICT regulator in creating an enabling environment for ICT growth and development is critical. Working behind the scenes, regulators ensure fair market prices, fair operating conditions for service providers, and most importantly, fair prices for consumers. The frameworks developed and implemented by each and every national regulator serve as the cornerstone of the country's ICT market development. Put the right policies in place and ICT market will flourish. Get the policy mix wrong and you can slow down growth and discourage investment. In today's increasingly converged ICT environment, ITU believes all regulators from the smallest markets to the largest and most powerful can benefit from international dialogue, the chance to share experiences and the opportunity to discuss and define best practice. ITU's Global Symposium for Regulators has grown quickly to become the preeminent annual event for the global regulatory community. With the theme of the fourth generation regulation, this year's unmissable event is kindly being hosted by the Republic of Poland under the honorary patronage of His Excellency Bonislav Komorowski, President of the Republic of Poland. On days one and two, the Global Regulators Industry Dialogue brings the essential voice of industry into the discussion. On day three, we privilege the regulatory and policy-making community, promoting free and frank exchange that culminates in a set of guidelines to help regulators navigate their way through increasingly uncharted waters. I encourage everyone who has something to say on the shape of tomorrow's ICT regulation to join other top policymakers from around the world in Warsaw, Poland, from 3 to 5 July for a stimulating and productive program of high-level discussion and in-depth debate.